Experts van het Nationaal Archief India gisteravond, hebben gisteravond hun inzichten gedeeld hoe archieven het best bewaard kunnen worden en hoe deze op een duurzame manier beschikbaar te stellen aan het grote publiek. In een volle zaal van het Nationaal Archief Suriname presenteerde Sri Sayed Farid Ahmed, adjunct directeur van het Nationaal Archief India, de strategie die het Indiaanse archief hiervoor toepast. Belangrijk is dat originele reeds gedigitaliseerde archieven niet meer toegankelijk zijn voor het publiek. We are not showing the records which has been digitized. We are not providing the original files. Whichever file has been digitized, scholars they are supposed to see that digitized version. We are not uh, uh, giving the original files just to keep the records intact and taking the full care. That was the mechanism earlier adopted through the doing the microfilms. Microfilm was the purpose that any file which is very, very important to avoid its higher use, they, the scholars were being provided the microfilm that it could not damage the original files. Sri Shayat Farid Ahmed legde verder uit dat het belangrijk is om getraind personeel te hebben dat kan zorg dragen voor de archieven. Het is belangrijk dat elk archief trainingscentrum heeft. Of course, any archives it requires a trained personnel. Trained persons, then uh, there are many uh, many archives who have their training centers, like National Archives of India. We do have a, a training institute which is called the School of Archival Studies. I have shared the uh, details with Madam. Uh, so international students, they are also coming uh, for those uh, short-term courses, one-year courses. Uh, our fees is very, uh, very nominal. Uh, so a uh, lot of uh, many foreign countries, uh, students, they are also coming um, for these tra training classes. But now many of the uh, Western countries, they have developed. Initially, there were only few countries because when the Britishers left, they had already introduced that training center in 1941. De lezing was onderdeel van het Cultural Exchange programma tussen Suriname en India, waarvoor twee Indiaanse archiefexperts naar Suriname gekomen zijn om de workshop te verzorgen voor de DIF-medewerkers.